Hi everyone, I am Turbo Pascal, aka Butelka64, and this is Citizen Motion 2. Last time, browsing the forums, I had an idea. I came up with the idea of connecting the whole city with only bosses. So, here we go. I have just launched the sandbox mode. And this is actually the north city provided with the game. It looks pretty good and it's also quite good to cover with bosses and trolley bosses too. And yeah, I was reading about those people, I was reading the, the posts complaining about uh, the metro system being still being OP. Uh, and that means that the metro system uh, built at the very beginning of the game gives you the money to do like everything. I didn't want to check that out. I didn't want to just waste my time making thousands of metro stations and stuff. But I just wanted to have fun in a little harder way. So there we go. I have just launched my sandbox mode and I'm gonna have fun with bosses. I have disabled the city growth because I was reading about some issues uh, with bosses downgrading some city zones and I don't want that to happen and I don't really need the city to build new new infrastructure as that what I that what is there for the moment is just fine I don't need any any new stuff uh, apparently I don't I don't think I will need to uh, any new buildings and I have limited money as you see so that's uh, 100,000 at the beginning and I have the ability to take loans but uh, I don't think I will take a lot of them and I, here we go with the first random objective let's see what it says uh, oh QL Aurora my rate latest exhibition is scheduled to open soon, but for some reason my audience has proved too dense to interpret my data-influenced adver advertisements correctly. They have no idea where the exhibition is being held. I need mass transit to get everyone there, even if they have shown themselves to be unworthy of my sophisticated art. There we go, somebody wants us to connect an art gallery with the line and transport so many people using the line. So that's not to the art gallery, but using the line, so that's fine. Let's see. Get the art gallery right right here. And I think it will be a nice spot to, to begin, actually. So, a good suggestion. I'll take that. And here we go. Let's see some bus lines. Or actually, let's see. I think this is a good environment for some trolleybus lines. I like placing them near some industrial... No, no, I will go just with bosses, okay. Bosses are fine. I don't need the trolleybuses right now. So yeah, let's go for it. So I need the art gallery covered. It's actually another, another thing here, it's a museum. Some commercial buildings, some office buildings around. Some nice stuff. So this is apparently a nice place to begin. A small line connecting some people to some leisure places, some shopping places, and to their workplaces right here. So I think I will start the line right here in this in this pretty little estate. And yeah, I will need, obviously I will need a bus depot. Let's see, this is, I think this is a good spot for one. This is actually, oh, I noticed that it's snapping to the, to a perfect spot so that I don't pay too much for the, for the depot. Okay, there we go, thank you. So we've got a basic depot and I'm gonna place some stops real quick.
There we go. I have the steps. Let's now go for the line. That won't be that won't be difficult, so I will just do it. As you see it right here, connecting all the stops. I actually won't be doing the depot ABCA depot model of the line. I think I don't need this at the moment because I have made a nice uh, a nice stop for the people that need to get off the bus from the depot and this is actually the end of the line so I don't think anyone will uh, will bother to just go further than this stop so that's fine to just connect it to the depot and and see how things work okay so the scheduled the estimated time for a single circle on the line is actually four hours but I have to extend it to like four, five, five and a half an hour because this estimation is really inaccurate. So I'll I'll have some <coughs> I'll have some tweaks to the to the timetable. I'll have the interval increased to three hours because I don't want too many buses to run here right now. And there we go. Do we need rush our We'll see. We'll see how the rush hour works out. Yeah, so I'll set up it right in middle, in the middle between, between the normal schedule. Okay, the night schedule can can stay actually, and this one can can stay too. I'll see how it works, and if you use the line all day, all night, as as they will probably do. The timetable is done, I just need three bosses and I'm ready to go. I will have, let's say I will have two bosses, uh, two Sternberger Dreifach bosses, because I like them, just because I like them, there we go, and one large bus, a Jubilee for tourists. Okay, there we go, three bosses are in the depot waiting to go on the line, line is set up. Let's take a look at the ticket prices. The ticket prices should be just fine. They are. I'll just leave it like this at the moment. I'll actually have some increase in the allow of overcrowding between the drivers and actually give them a little rise. A little raise. I don't know how it's spelled. And yeah, 12.0 should be should be good. I'll have one one ticket inspector working for the moment. The wage of 14 is just fine. Let's see. Uh, the ticket inspector is actually making a little a little loose, but this will this will be the opposite soon. So I'm hoping for the good. Okay, the line is set up. I hope it's working right now. There should be a departure in a, in a couple of minutes. And yeah, I'm just waiting to transport people to the transport some people using the line. That won't be that won't be hard. So I'm moving forward to another line. And I will make another line in the middle of the city center because it's a nice nice spot for the uh, for the white collar workers. There we go. Have a data layer here. They they actually have lots of homes over here, but I at the moment I don't need to connect the suburb to the center. I only just have some lines running right to the city center and ending like uh, somewhere around somewhere around the center. Oh yeah, this is a good spot. To finish a line. I'll see. Can I demolish some buildings here to make a depot? Let's see. I will need to make the depot here, but that's not a problem. There we go. So I got a depot and I will make some stops. Actually, also, like the first time, I will do it really quickly.
There we go. I got the stops. I will s set up the line. It's actually a good line connecting uh, the blue color, the white color workers to their workplaces. And there are actual, actually also some some shopping places on the road. Some some other places to go. So I hope people will like the road. There we go. There's the depot, the first stop. Actually, on this one, I think I will be using the Depot ABCA Depot scam as I have only one stop there, and I apparently don't want the bus to go go back to the depot each time. So I hope it works nicely. I had to make a bigger loop over here because these are some uh, one-way roads. I don't really like them, but they are there, so I have to. I have to just. Uh, to build like the like the map designer wanted me to. There we go. Stop 17 first, stop 17 last. I think the whole circle will be will will be during uh, will take like four hours. is done. I hope it works nicely for me. Let's see the buses. Again I'll choose... Actually I'll buy two of these to ensure that people don't get mad about overcrowded... and just one one medium bus. That will be just fine. Okay, one bus has already is already out of the depot. It's driving on the on the line. There we go. Hello, little bus. Okay, we've got the line, and let's see how is our first line doing. It's actually bringing passengers to their destinations, and I like it. And the large bus is has nine passengers on board. Well, that's fine because the line has just started to work so more later the more people will use it okay some blue color workers are actually using it and that's good and yeah that's the beginning and I'll be continuing this a little bit later I hope you guys enjoyed and I hope we can see each other in the in the next next episode I will be doing some further some further gameplay and I'll, I'll talk to you guys soon this has been Turbo Pascal and I'm signing out <laughs>